Hey guys, welcome to Planning with Crystal. So today is another advent calendar unboxing and this one is the Elle Magazine Beauty Calendar for 2021. And this is one I am really impressed with. So I think you guys will be interested in this too because the reveal video got a lot of views. A lot of people seem to really like this calendar and why not? Because it's an amazing value. So this one originally retails at £149, but if you can get it on a deal and I've got a link that'll take you straight to that deal, you can get it for £120 and it's worth £6. £662. One thing I really like about Elle, and they did this last year as well, they include a little magazine here, leaflet, leaflet, we'll say, and it actually tells you a little bit about every product inside. So if you're not sure about what the product is, what it does, you don't even have to research it yourself because the information's all here. And it tells you the individual price of each individual item, which is something I work out myself usually. And the prices they've got are pretty accurate. They've kind of rounded up or down instead of like getting it to the pence like I do but it should make it really easy for me to do this video for you as well, which is great. And the box itself as well is really nice. We also get a 12 month digital subscription to Elle magazine, which I think is a really nice touch. So you can download that to your phone, iPad, whatever, um, and get a whole year's worth of the magazine, which is awesome. So that kind of bumps up the value a bit more as well. So it comes in this lovely black and white box and it just has this kind of slip cover. And it's just this lovely black and white design. So I guess it's not very festive, but it is the sort of box that would look fab all year round if you're just using it to store things in. It's really well made. Last year's box, I don't know if you watched my unboxing of that and I'll put a card here if you want to go back and watch it, but it was just like a standard advent calendar where almost like a chocolate, traditional chocolate calendar where you're opening the doors, it's plasticky, it's not reusable. This year, it's definitely reusable and there is no plastic. It almost reminds me colour wise of like net -a -porte or something like that with the kind of black and white and things. So inside the doors you can see we've got like a contrasting black and white pattern on both sides. We've got numbers as you would expect in an advent calendar. The only thing I would say is in terms of reusability it would have been even better if the drawers had been reversible like in the John Lewis calendar where it's not got a number on the other side but it's still got the cut out and then you can use it for storage but you could cover the numbers up. I'll just leave them there if you're not bothered um, but yeah definitely reusable definitely great for storage and stuff so very very happy with the actual makeup of the calendar as well so in this video I'm obviously going to show you everything in the calendar I'm going to tell you what everything is what it does what size it is how much it's worth and then hopefully that will help you to decide if it's a calendar for you I'm pleased to say as well the calendar is still in stock which surprises me with how much kind of excitement there is around it so if you do want to get one it is still available at the time of making the video so in here it says, sparkling, sturdy and stuffed full of stellar beauty, this is a surefire way to make every day in December joyful. And I would agree with that. So we're just going to kick it right off with door number one, which is here. And it's a small kind of slim one. So that's like quite a hard reinforced cardboard box. So it's quite all put together and everything. And day number one is a full size, good start. So this is the Huda Beauty Legit Lashes. So this is a two in one mascara. One end is for volume, the other is for curl and length. So it's size wise, it's two times eight and a half mils or two times zero. 0.28 fluid ounces even has like a before and after on there so it all looks very promising so it's in very vanta which is an extreme black why they don't just put black I, I don't know but there we go so this is what your packaging looks like so it's kind of like a triangle shape and it's got the two sides to it and there's no excuse for not knowing which is which because it actually tells you on the side which is which. So this is curl and lengthen and they recommend you go in with curl and lengthen first to curl and lengthen and then you go in with this other end which is volume to apply a little bit of volume once you've applied the first mascara. So I've spoke about this before I think in like favourites videos and things and I do tend to have more success with mascara when I use two different ones because you just get the best of both worlds if it's two different ones. So this is a great option because it's all together in one. This retails at £24 and Huda Beauty does some gorgeous beauty stuff. So it says we want great lashes every day, that's a given. But some days we want them fluttery and curled, others we want them length and in your face volume. This is the answer to both. A dual ended mascara with different brushes, formulas and vibes, a makeup bag essential. So you could definitely do that. You could have like your day to day look and then top it up with the other for a night look or just go with your mood and just use one side of it. Day number two 
just realised as well, there's actually a little bit of a sparkle there in the card, which makes it extra fun. Didn't notice that before when I first had a look. So today it's another full size. This is by Nails Inc. It's Blame It On The Glitter Ball, which is a very sparkly red. Very, very festive, isn't it? So this is 14 mils or 0.47 fluid ounces. And it says here it's worth 15 pounds. If you can't go red and sparkly at Christmas, when can you? This gives glitter in a big way. Chunky, light reflecting, show stopping and long wear to boot. The wide nail hugging brush makes at home application easy while the kale extract helps to nourish nails. I do use Nails Ink from time to time. It's not my absolute favourite in nail varnishes. That would be nail berry at the moment, but it is pretty good. So I will look forward to playing around that. I'm definitely more of a sparkly red kind of nail person at that time of year. So I definitely will make use of that. Day number three. Ooh, so this. I've got a story for you with this one. Today we get another full size. We're doing well with full sizes, aren't we? This is the Eve Lom Kiss Mix, seven mils or 0.23 fluid ounces. So it's a fancy lip balm. I'm gonna basically unwrap it now and show you it. So I like that it comes boxed because sometimes we get full size items in calendars that aren't boxed. And I don't know, boxes just make me feel even more like it's a real true full size and not just like one they've done for a calendar. But this was the first fancy lip balm I ever got. I got it from Space NK and I think at the time it was about £12, but that was maybe like 15 years ago. It was a long time ago and prices obviously it's gone up since then. This is what it looks like. So it looks like a solid lip balm. Just remember feeling so fancy when I got this and just trying to conserve it. So like I would only allow myself to apply it once a day and then use my cheaper lip balms the rest of the time just because it costs so much. So it has a kind of minty-ish scent, nothing too strong, it's really subtle. Almost like you've just finished a chewing gum a while ago. So it's just got a tiny bit of mintiness. So you can feel the slightest, slightest tingle, but not unpleasant or like almost painful like some tingly lip balms can be. This for me is like an ultimate winter lip balm. It's just so kind of moisturizing, protecting, and it gives the lips that little bit of kind of glow as well to them. So, you know, a little bit of shine and things. If you don't want to put lipstick on, but you want your lips to just look nice, this is a good option for that, but oh, it's just lovely. It says hydrates lips up to 10 hours after use. I'm not sure I agree with that. How can anything do it for that long? But it is really, really lovely. So this is seven mil or 0.23 fluid ounce full size. It's a gorgeous product. I'm really happy to have it. When I saw it was in here, I thought, oh, I've not used that for ages and I think I'm gonna fall back in love. So this is worth 16 pounds it is now. This wonder combines Eve Lom's legendary Kiss Mix Balm with a hint of a tint for that just bitten flush. I don't think it does. I don't think it's got a colour to it, has it? It looks exactly the same as it used to and it seems to be like clear, so I don't know. Anyway, it says formulated with amino and palmitic acid and refreshing menthol, it gives chapped winter lips a peachy hit. Peachy? I, I think mine's clear. Let me know if you get this, whether yours is tinted, mine I don't think is. It, doesn't look like it is. The nourishing formula gets to work soothing and hydrating for a perfectly kissable pout. And it also plays really well with lipstick if you're gonna go over the top with lipstick, which I think there might be lipstick in here, so I'll be able to show you that shortly. Day number four. Okay, so we've got a skincare item. This is by Sharni Darden, and it's the Retinol Reform Lactic and Retinol. Retinol and lactic acid serum, 10 mils or 0.3 fluid ounces. It's cruelty free, vegan, oil free, fragrance free. So this is a brand, it's pretty high end and you only kind of get it from certain places. Like I think like Harvey Nicks sells it. I think possibly Liberty, those kinds of stores. So you know it's probably gonna be pretty good and pretty pricey. So this, it says new to the UK, the skin perfecting product has become a firm favorite of many an A-list in the US. Potent enough to create positive change, this, this is formulated to boost collagen and smooth the skin's surface, but remains gentle enough for sensitive skin types. And this is worth £27 in that 10 mil size. That's the only danger of getting like fancy skincare products in these calendars. What if you fall in love and like want to buy the full size? But beauty calendars do remain one of the best ways to try lovely like skincare makeup and see what you know, discover new things. Day number five. So today we've got a body oil. This is the Nukes 
bio-organic replenishing nourishing body oil in hazelnut it's 35 mils or 1.1 fluid ounces and it says for dry skin um does it have a hazelnut scent maybe although hazelnuts don't have a massive scent but i kind of know what they mean so the replenishing nourishing body oil is worth 11 pounds and it says this 100 percent natural body oil from nukes heroes the skin softening powers of cold pressed hazelnut oil along with a botanical blend of sesame safflower and sunflower oils apply all over your body to treat skin to some intense nourishment which is definitely needed in the colder months it's not an easy kind of applicator it's just a sort of circular hole in the top of the bottle which appears to be kind of plastic and this is what it looks like so you can see the glow there from the oil cake put this on your legs and make your legs look all shiny on a night out it does seem to spread quite evenly and easily anyway and it gives a little bit of a glow to the skin and hopefully it will moisturize it does feel more like a dry oil as well so it doesn't feel like it's going to be greasy or you're gonna to have to wait ages to put your clothes on after you apply it so that looks quite promising day number six so today we've got something by Darfan Paris was it Daffin? Daffin Paris. And this is the Intral Toner with Chamomile for sensitive skin. It's a 50ml or 1.7 fluid ounce size. I haven't used that much from this range actually. Let me know if you have. So this particular one is in this size is worth £8. I think it's like a travel size. Forget what you think you know about toner. This one is soothing, never stripping, refreshing, not drying, and helps to rebalance and refresh the skin post-cleanse, pre-moisturiser, or you can use it as the perfect preparation for pampering facial treatments. Importantly, it smells gorgeous too. Oh, it does. It smells kind of fruity, which I didn't expect. I expected something floral, but it smells quite fruity to me. But a nice, sensitive, gentle toner. That sounds good for winter just to kind of Put a bit more moisture into the skin day number seven and we've got another full size this one is by aromatherapy associates it's the forest therapy rollerball in a 10 ml or 0.33 fluid ounce size so i have used these before and we have seen them in other scents in other calendars much more expensive calendars i might add so it's a little glass vial like this it's got a gold lid on top which is kind of like plastic and metal and it's a roller ball so what you do is you roll it onto your pulse points and then breathe in the oil and it's supposed to kind of relax you or put you in that mood and this is out of all of the ones they do one i have wanted to try for a while so i've tried like they do one called like deep relax and revive so ones to revive you ones to kind of relax you this one is all about kind of almost like forest bathing so i actually have the bath oil in forest therapy from aromatherapy associates that i bought myself because it's fab it's a fab brand and i love the smell of the forest therapy almost as like close your eyes and just pretend that you're in a hot bath in the middle of a forest or something or like a hot tub in the middle of a forest that'd be nice wouldn't it that's what i think of anyway and you know what if it really isn't your thing you could even gift it or put it as like a stocking filler because it is in its own box and everything Forest bathing, rooted in the Japanese practice of Shinrin-yoku, is the act of self-soothing by reconnecting with nature with incredible calming benefits. The blend of oils in this rollerball, cypress, pine and hoe wood, will help to transport you into nature in a swipe. And it does, it kind of smells like a forest. I don't know how else to describe it, but that is a brilliant one. I'm really happy to see that in there. So it's not a perfume, it's more of an aromatherapy kind of treatment oil day number eight okay so this is a full size and this is one i was really looking forward to and just such an amazing value so this is a full sized product from murad and it's the intense recovery cream soothing moisturizer for face and eyes 50 mils or 1.7 fluid ounces so sticker on the top that says resale is strictly prohibited i guess because they probably get hold of it for the calendar at much less of the cost than it actually retails for so this is a funny little product i got a sample of it a while ago i think i may have spoken about it before and i am so impressed so it's like a funny almost looks like a balm sort of texture and it's like a greenish color it has i don't even know how to describe the scent it has a nice scent i don't know how to describe it but it has a nice scent and it's like a really funny texture it's kind of almost like a balmy kind of texture but it is so hydrating but it doesn't break out the skin and it does soothe if you've got any irritation and it's just amazing so this is actually worth 68 pounds because it is a full size 
and it says a glass or two of wine a long soak in the bath and a cheesy rom-com might be the cure for a stressed mind but stressed skin needs a different approach for an improved complexion and reduced fine lines this rich cream for face and eyes is just the ticket soothing hydrating calming it's amazing seriously this is one that i love the sample that much i intended to repurchase it and then when i saw it in this calendar i was like that's the one i need day number nine so this isn't one i'm particularly excited for it's not something i'll use it's something i will probably pass on it's the vita liberator body blur high definition body makeup so this is like an instant tan i think it's just like you apply it for a night out that kind of thing it's just not my thing and the shade they've sent is latte dark which is medium to dark so it's definitely not going to work for my skin tone they do a light to medium so i think it might be random as to which one you get the one in the picture just says latte i think that might be light to medium this is in a 50 ml 1.69 fluid ounce size quite a decent size it's called the body blur instant hd skin finish and it's worth 15 pound 50. the closest thing you'll get to clicking your fingers and achieving instant perfection Vita Liberator's Body Blur Cream is adored by beauty editors for giving lackluster limbs a speedy glow. Smooth over arms and legs for an Instagram filter effect. Yeah, just not one for me personally, but I think it's the only item in here that I'm not that keen on. Everything else, I'm like, yes, please. Day number 10. Ooh, so today we get a full-size makeup item. This is by Fenty Beauty. So they're doing really well with, you know, the really kind of cool brands and things. This is called the Matchstick Shimmer Skin Stick. It's 0.25 ounces or 7.10 grams. So it's Fenty Beauty by Rihanna. And the shade we have is Beach Bum, which I think everyone gets the same shade. So it's in this kind of funky plastic hexagonal packaging. And this is what it looks like. I should really have applied this to my face today. I don't know why I didn't. It's kind of, um, I'm going to say like a corally kind of colour. But it looks like it might be quite a nice like liquid blush i'd put it on but i actually already have a liquid blush on so this actually retails at 21 pounds and it says a true multitasker this shimmer skin stick combines a peach blush color with a golden highlighter and a blendable balm that gives a whole lot of glow with a cruelty free formula and smart magnetized packaging there is nothing that fenty hasn't thought of but another one again that comes in the box and i just think that's really cool good product and it looks like the sort that will probably blend quite well it's almost dried down to a kind of powder formula even though it's cream interesting i look forward to playing around with that but that looks more like um it'll give a natural kind of glowy finish to the skin day number 11 so today is a teeny tiny one but it's still one i'm really excited to see because it's by size lit paris which is really ridiculously expensive as a brand but they do so many amazing things and this is a black rose precious face oil which i've never tried i've tried other things from the black rose range and it's brilliant very expensive but they've included a three mil one so it is teeny teeny tiny however this particular size is actually worth 20 pounds which is crazy isn't it but there we go I have high hopes. This ultra indulgent face oil has a silky smooth texture that sinks into your skin, formulated with a blend of plant-based ingredients and a trio of luxurious black rose extract, Bulgarian rose oil and magnolia. Just a few drops help to smooth fine lines and wrinkles. So I cannot wait to play around with that. Day number 12. Today we've got shampoo by Feke. I hope I'm pronouncing that correctly, probably not. This is the full blown volume shampoo. Created by celebrity hairdresser Frederic Feke. This shampoo is the antidote to limp flat hair, promising to deliver twice the volume for up to eight hours. You can enjoy bouncy hair guilt free thanks to a vegan and cruelty free formula and recyclable packaging. This is a travel size worth eight pounds and it's 60 mils or two fluid ounces. There's no silicone, sulfates, parabens or anything like that in there as well. So that's good. Um, I've never tried this particular one. I think we've had this brand in one of these calendars before, but not that particular one. My hair is super flat and fine. So that sounds like a good one for me to try. Day number 13. So today we get a product by Aurelia. Now I have already got this in my collection and I've been using it recently. And it's a lovely kind of cream cleanser, like a balmy cream type texture. And it also comes with a lovely little cloth. How cute is this? And the softest little cloth as well. I've been enjoying this. It definitely feels like a real kind of nice comforting winter cleanser. So this is worth £22. I believe it's a travel size. 
This creamy but light aromatic formula lifts away the day's makeup and grime without leaving skin feeling stripped and tight. Bonus points for the soft bamboo cloth which adds a gentle exfoliation while removing the cleanser. So it's just a really lovely one to use. So it has got the aromatics, but they're not overpowering or unpleasant. It's just a really nice, like I said, gentle kind of wrap your skin in cashmere feeling cleanser. So it's really nice. Day number 14. So today we've got a benefit product and this is the 24 hour brow setter. 24 hour invisible shaping and setting gel for brows. 3.5 mils or 0.11 US fluid ounces. So it is a mini size. The great thing about this is because it's clear, it's just gonna work for anyone's brows. So I use these, I've used it today. And once I've applied a little bit of eyebrow pencil, I just use them to set the brows in place. And what's great about this over others I've used is it sets them gently so they do stay put all day and everything but it's not sort of drying or tight whereas there's certain ones i've used that make it feel a little bit uncomfortable almost and a bit too stuck in place this one's just a really good option i do think benefit do a fantastic job of brow products so this like i said is a travel size and is worth 12 pounds 50. benefits clear brow gel does what it says on the tin Promising brushed up, groomed brows for 24 hours. The invisible, flake-free formula means you won't end up with unfortunate brow dandruff, while the duo comb offers effective application using long bristled side and perfect shaping with the short bristles. So it's quite cleverly designed in that way that it's slightly different on each side depending on how you want to set your brows, or you can just do like both. Day number 15. Ooh, so this is just a brand I've just been loving so much recently and I think I've spoken about it in some of my other advent calendar videos. So it's Aveda and we've had some Aveda products in other calendars but not this specific one I don't think. I unbox that many I do forget which is in which after I've made the video I've got to be honest. So this is the Botanical Repair Strengthening Leave-In Treatment. Consider this leave-in formula super powered. Not only does it help to strengthen your hair from the inside out, it also detangles, reduces frizz and is heat protecting. This is your damaged lockdown hair's new best friend and it's nine pounds in this travel size. But that's quite a lot of product to have a go with and I'm excited because the range is just brilliant. And I think it's quite a new range that they've launched as well. So I'm excited to see that in here. Day number 16. Oh. So this is another kind of mega value product and it's a good one. So it's Dr. Barbara Sturm. Let's get, you get a bit of reflection because it's still in the sealed packaging. This is a super anti-aging serum in a 10 mil travel size on 0.33 fluid ounces. This is worth a hundred pounds. Don't get me wrong. I do think Dr. Barbara Sturm's products are very, very expensive. But when you have them, they are actually really good. And the anti-aging serum is probably my favourite of the products that they do. It's easier to list what the serum doesn't do than what it does. Such are its benefits. Antioxidants to protect, hyaluronic to hydrate, packed with peptides to boost skin quality while visibly reducing fine lines and wrinkles. It won't actually make you younger, but otherwise it's the perfect all-rounder. And it is a really good one. And it's quite, quite high viscosity. It's quite a thick serum sort of formula. So I think a little goes a long way with this as well, but it's just amazing day number 17 so today we've got an eye cream this is by elizabeth arden and it's the retinol ceramide line erasing eye cream in a five mil or 0.17 fluid ounce size so it is just in a kind of almost like a sample tube like this but five mils is i think a third of like a full size full size is usually 15 mils so it's still got quite a little bit of value included in there and there's plenty of product there to use and see if it's a good option for you this is actually worth 17 pounds in this size Combining its signature moisture boosting ceramide technology with clinically proven encapsulated retinol, Elizabeth Arden's Gentle Eye Cream helps to brighten, depuff and hydrate for eyes that look wide awake however long your week has been. So I've not used this one personally. I haven't used much in the way of Elizabeth Arden for a really long time actually. But that sounds interesting. I think with retinol eye creams it's that fine balance between it doing something and it irritating your eyes that's what i find it's like one or the other so i'm still on the hunt for the perfect one really so i look forward to trying that day number 18 okay so this is impressive we've got sol de janeiro's brazilian boom boom cream but in a travel size which is the 75 ml or 2.5 
fluid ounce size and I mention that because in some calendars when you get this you get like 25 mils unless it's a really expensive calendar so for this price point I actually think this is a really good deal so it's one of those if you've used it you'll know how good it is if you like the scent you'll love it if you don't like the scent you'll probably want to avoid it it's got quite a distinctive scent I personally really like it it reminds me of like tropical holidays so it's worth 18 pounds in this size it says becoming a cult beauty product as soon as it hit the UK. Sol de Janeiro's cheekily named body cream uses guana extract to give your buns a firming caffeine injection five times stronger than coffee. Perfect for stimulating circulation. Now that's what we call a Brazilian boom boom lift. You can of course use it all over your body. I just like it because of the scent and it's really thick and lovely and moisturising. Day number 19. So this is a super light one. Okay, so today we get a travel size of the Bobbi Brown Longwear Cream Eyeshadow Stick. I am wearing this today. I actually own it in a full size. So I'm gonna do a swatch from my full size, but I will show you the size we actually get. So it's a crayon. So I just like to put it on like that. Then you can either blend it out with your finger or a brush. I quite like using a brush actually, but you can see it sort of buffs down and the color kind of blends down into a little less and blends it just blends really well across the eyes or you can also build it up for like a more intense kind of look so the full size is a 1.6 gram or 0 0.05 ounces the travel size is 0 0.03 ounces or 0 0.9 grams so it's not a bad size and you can actually buy them in this travel size now and I'll just get this out so you can actually see how long the product is that we get so this is the one you're actually going to get in here and if I compare it to a full size, it looks a lot smaller, but actually in terms of the amount of products inside, it's not massively different. And you can actually buy this in the travel size for £14. So again, that kind of tells you what the value is. But I actually have it in a full size because I love the colour, love the formulation, and I just went out and bought it because I loved it. It was one of the colours I selected when I bought a few of them. And it's one I reach for a lot just to kind of give that little sweep of colour. And it also works well almost as like a base colour at times if you just want to put a little bit of colour down before you put anything else. And I find you can get away with not having an eyeshadow primer. I haven't got an eyeshadow primer on today because this sort of adheres itself to the lids until you remove it and then grips any eyeshadows you put on top, be that cream or shadow. So it's a really good base type shade as well. So it's in the shade Top. An icon among makeup products, Bobbi Brown's Shadow Sticks are a great example of a fuss-free, stunning formula. Simply swipe on and smudge to the desired finish. This fawny, warm top shade makes a great standalone look or a neutral base to build on. Ah, oh, so they agree. So yeah, it's a great one and it will last you ages in that size. I'd be amazed if people don't love it. It's great as well for obviously for travel and stuff. And like I said, you don't really need a brush. You can just get away with using that with your finger to give yourself that little bit of colour fabulous fabulous product day number 20 so today we've got a product by percy and reed and it's the time to shine oh my shine and fragrance spray it's in a 50 mils or 1.6 fluid ounce size so it's got uv protection it adds luminous gloss and fragrance to strands leaving hair soft and silky fine fragrance glossing mist specifically designed for all hair types and lengths so i've never used this hair perfume i'm sure it used to be like a big thing and lots of brands did it and then it sort of faded away and you don't hear much about it that seems to be my experience of it anyway so this is an interesting one we'll see what it smells like and if it does add a bit of shine i'll just put it on the end of my ponytail i think i'm always wary of these sorts of things making your hair like greasy or something it doesn't feel too bad but we'll see we'll see if it added a bit of shine it's got like um, a nice hair care scent. It doesn't smell like perfume or anything to me. So I guess it's quite a good one if you're just trying to freshen up your locks, make them smell better, maybe make it a little shiny, then, you know, go for it. So this is worth £12. And it says, what do you mean you don't use a hair fragrance? Don't knock it till you've tried it. A spritz of the shine enhancing spray leaves hair glossy with an English country garden inspired scent of rhubarb, rose, geranium and honey. Okay then. With each hair flick, you'll leave a waft of scent in your wake. I like the idea of that, that you just like smell it throughout the day. Interesting, I'll have to have more of a play around with it when I've got my hair down and stuff and see what it's like, but first impressions, interesting. Day number 21, kind of here in the middle of this row. And this is a product by Ico, and it's the Black Magic Liquid Eyeliner and Wide Lash. 
waterproof lash enhancing precision brush carbon black it's 0.3 mils or 0.01 us fluid ounces so i have got this on i'm not going to open this one because i have already got it on from one that i have it's a nice enough eyeliner it's ico it's a funny one i don't they work but not quite well enough to repurchase it's an, a decent enough liquid eyeliner anyway so if you need a black eyeliner and most people do from at some point then this is an option now it's telling me it's worth 16 pounds i'm not sure if that's right that doesn't sound right for a miniature but there we go it's like a travel size a cool product for a reason this might just be the perfect liquid liner jet black with a fine tip for, for precision it's seriously smudge proof with a staying power of up to 12 hours plus the vitamin b5 leaves, leaves lashes feeling loved what more could you ask for to be fair it has got a nice point on it actually and it does seem to be smudge proof i've had it on a few hours and it seems to be staying where i put it day number 22 so today we've got a face serum by 111 skin and it's the y theorem repair serum and it's 10 mils on 0.34 fluid ounces apply after cleansing to face and neck and this is what it looks like so this has appeared in advent calendars before on 111 skin it's a funny brand in that i find i have more success with the masks like the sheet masks than i do all the other products that they do don't know why that is it says in the winter months everything can seem a bit dull and gray including your complexion this serum formulated by renowned harley street cosmetic surgeon dr yanis alexandres is the antidote formulated to speed up cell regeneration and collagen production which promotes bouncier brighter skin and this is worth 63 pounds so maybe i need to give it another try at 63 pounds i would be expecting it to be pretty fantastic it's another kind of hit and miss brand i think 111 skin they do amazing products and then they do okay products day number 23 down here this is a super lightweight one so we've got a laura mercier lipstick and i'm going to apply it for you now just so that we can see what this is like if i can get into it it's kind of stuck down with like a barcode -y thing which is good because it you know it's not been opened or anything but um it's making it a bit difficult uh so it's like a classic red shade i've had a laura mercier mini lipstick before i don't know if it was this shade or not i don't think it was this is the rouge ultu ultume in 460 i always feel a bit nervous like applying a lipstick like the first time you apply it it's a bit like i don't know it seems a shame to break that kind of perfect finish but let's do it so I'm going over the Kiss Mix I had on from Eve Lom. So like I said, it usually plays quite well with lipstick. So it's quite a bright red, isn't it? So yeah, not too difficult to apply. It seems kind of shaped quite well. I like the glossy effect of it as well. Like some reds can be quite muted and matte and this is not that. This it automatically feels quite hydrating. Always makes your teeth look whiter, I find, a red lipstick. So definitely a Christmassy red, isn't it? Definitely a classic red. So if you're not into red lip, of course you can blot it down and maybe mix it with a bit of the lip balm just to give yourself a hint of red instead of the big red colour. So this is the Rouge Essential Mini Lipstick worth £9.50 and it's super cute. Definitely fit in your handbag, wouldn't it? Lipstick trends come and go, matte and pale, sheer and plummy, high gloss and pink, but there's one staple everyone should have in their arsenal, a satin red. The scarlet shade is a perfect suits all, one swipe bullet that will see you through any last minute makeup moments and in a handy size too. So I'm happy with that, love Laura Mercier products anyway and this, yeah, gorgeous. Day number 24, Christmas Eve. So today we get an eye mask and it's by the brand Claire de Pure Beauté, which they've recently started stocking at Cult Beauty. It's not a brand I'd heard of, but it seems to be quite pricey and therefore hopefully really good. So it's the Vitality Enhancing Eye Mask Supreme. And it's just one sheet, which is 15 mils or 0.5 fluid ounces. It says to leave it on for 10 minutes and then pat in any of the remaining essence. This eye mask takes dark circles and puffiness reduction to the next level. Infused with the essence of iris extract, it plumps, smooths and brightens under eyes for a radiant finish. It seems like a really big packet for one eye mask. It almost feels like it's one complete mask, like as if it's just going to go all the way across the eyes instead of just being two under the eyes. So I look forward to trying that and Christmas Eve sounds like the perfect time to use it before the next day when you're taking all your Christmassy pictures. So that is worth £22. So 
yes i'm expecting to wake up looking like 20 years younger around the eyes or something and then finally day 25 christmas day <laughs> this is quite a big draw and at first i was hoping there'd be like multiple products in but there isn't there is just this but this is fab and something else i was looking forward to in here so it's the foreo luna play plus two it's a facial cleansing massager and i've got it in minty cool which refers to the color i think there might be different colors available so it says deep yet gentle cleansing ultra hygienic silicone relaxing facial massage suitable for all skin types so this is a tiny but mighty t-sonic facial cleansing massager and i had one years ago and the battery ran out that's the only problem with this you can't replace the battery but it does say you get more than 600 uses so it should last quite a long time the one thing i really do like about a silicone brush as opposed to any other type of brush is it does tend to stay clean so you don't have to worry about bacteria or anything building up which you really don't want with something that you're massaging on your face but i look forward to using this with my cleansers i think i'll get a lot of fun out of this it's worth 49 pounds and it says the master of modern face tools foreo has changed the game for facial cleansing and the adorable luna play plus two is no exception made from waterproof ultra hygienic silicone it's small but mighty lasting for 600 uses it's 8,000 pulses per minute help to give the most effective face wash ever so if you think of using it twice a day it should last almost a year or if you're using it once a day almost two years that's like some quick math but there we go so that's quite exciting so what do i think of this calendar i think it's fantastic i think you should go and buy it immediately i have opened a lot of high-end calendars you may have watched unboxings some are still to come but this at this price point of 120 is one to be in my opinion i actually think it's really good i think it's got some great products in it and great brands and obviously it depends on what you want you might dislike everything in the calendar we're all different but for me i think it's really really good for that price point love the fact they're including a year's subscription of the digital magazine i think that's just great love that they're doing that there's also some money off codes at the back of the booklet that you get sent so you can get 25 percent off at foreo 20 percent off at aurelia 15 percent off at bobby brown 20 percent off at percy and reed so you can repurchase some of the items or other items from their ranges and get a discount which is cool why don't they all do that i love that it's 25 day and I love the way they put the calendar together it looks really pretty I think this year and it looks really kind of cool and definitely something you could reuse so this is a really good calendar I'm really quite impressed with it let me know in the comments what you think of this calendar have you picked it up or will you be picking it up like I said I'll drop a link underneath if you want to get it for 120 pounds while stocks last and that includes free UK delivery so I would love it if you give this video a thumbs up it lets me know you're enjoying the content I'm producing and I'd love it if you'd subscribe to the channel and click the notification bell to be notified when my next video goes live still lots of advent calendar videos unboxings reveals and stuff to come Thank you so much for watching. Bye guys.